Looks like there's another one in there. Yeah, which is now just getting involved. That's what he missed. No, don't miss. Oh. Reload. I did damage. So you're chipping away at our health. Yeah, dear. I don't really want to run away. I'm, I'm kind of... <gasps> I killed a thing! I killed a thing. I did a killing. Please don't die, guys. We need you alive. Yeah, if either of these two guys were in trouble. <gasps> killed a thing again. More, more things are being killed. Oh, I hit Sulek. Boo. You killed Sulek. I know it's probably, it's it's death by a thousand cuts, but like, I can't fight. I can't fight without Sulek. I yeah, without Sulek, I'm in trouble. Like Sulek, he's Cassie's gonna get swamped. How come? How come Lenny didn't move that turn? I mean, I'll try pushing on, but we'll probably end up get getting attacked. Cassidy will get probably fall, and then I'm gonna get killed myself. I probably should have run away a bit earlier. That's the issue I've had. Uh, if I'd run away earlier, I could have. We could have just survived and whatever. Oh well. Right. I'm not dead, somehow. Barely alive. I mean, I'm doing this. I'm probably not going to be able to... Why is Cassidy running? I assume I hit a body of, of a mutated pig rat rather than the actual rat I was after. It's the problem with the roofs, that the way they're done, is you can't really see what you're... I can't see what's going on. I need to march in. This is going to go badly, isn't it? I see, I got a lot of my stuff. Cassidy's being a wimp and running around. Oh well. Okay. We'll push further in. I missed. Oh yeah, he's running away, isn't he? My aim is blocked. I don't know what what is it blocked by? It's not dead. That's stupid. Why is it walking past things trying to kill it? Eh. No. Eh. I need to reload anyway. I'm kind of hoping I die and then this is all pointless. And then I get Shulik. Shulik survives. Maybe I should have been. Oh my goodness, we're gonna die. Yeah, I can't. I can't. Yeah. Oh well. 
Look. Yeah, losing Tulik and Cassidy, we are never winning another fight. And I missed anyway. Right. There we go. We died. We we killed everything but a rat. Oh, um, where did I last? Yeah, we're going to... Bartering. So now I've got to go all the way back. Now I've got to try going back to... Back to Reading. Then I think... Yeah, I wanted to explore that area. But I think now we'll get to Reading... Uh, and then when we get to Reading, once we get to Reading, we will just save and call the session there, I think. Um, and then it's the question of we could wait there for a period, um, and then go on a go go with a caravan somewhere. Or we could just walk to Broken Hills. Going with the caravans would probably be safer, I would guess. Um, but we'd have to wait. And I think once again, we're going to rest until morning. Um, so this is basically when we were anyway. But yeah, so if we, if we go up here, then we could um, see... Blah blah blah. Then we can think about maybe car going to a caravan um, and uh, kind of heading somewhere else. Or we may just—I don't think there's like the one quest was the sheriff, and he says we're too low level for it, basically. Um, but then, hello, you live here, okay? Um, yeah, so through here is the place. Like, there's nowhere here that seems to have a wrench. Like, I thought maybe the mining place, one of the mines might have done. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I know I said I was just gonna stop, but uh, obviously I was lying, uh, it seems. Um, are there any other kind of green areas that I've missed? Yes, there is this one here. Uh, let's, let's actually, considering what just happened... Let's get over there, but then let's save as we exp stop, as we're exploring. I just want to see what's over here. Like the other one is death. Uh, save game. Exploring Reading. Oh, this is just back here. Uh, no, no, we're not staying here. So this just loops around, okay. Run! I I have a premonition about what happened last time. What happened an, uh, another time. No, Cassidy. Cassidy. Cassidy, no. Cassidy. Cassidy, no. Oh, everything's going to activate. Ugh. Oh, I was looking for a kill. Okay, we got one kill. And I'll take that and leave. For destroying your enemies and that taking a scratch, you at 90 experience points. Uh, so that's where that goes to. Oh, I wonder if there's a wrench in here, actually. I assume that... The, oh, there's different mining named places. Different names of mines. Maybe... Oh, no. Okay, are they all out of order, though? Ooh. No, that's the thing that was out of order. Hmm. But it doesn't look like there's any kind of spaces around that might have a wrench. We're gonna, yeah, we'll keep looking. May as well just have a quick look in here, see if there is a wrench. Hello. Hello there, I'm Marge. Marge the Barge and I run this mine. Are you a Reading native? No, I was born way up north, right on the edge of a lake. Lake La Barge it was. Uh, let me, uh, I've never heard of it. Let me ask something else. What can Marge do for you? Uh, know about any jobs or anything else? There's always rumours, but I do have something that needs doing. Tell me about the rumours. Well, there's always these rumours about Reading being taken over, or about one of Mingo's coming out of the graveyard, or, or at night. Someone even said that they saw some kind of flying machine go overhead a few months ago. 
uh, what what did you hear about takeover? People always talk about Vault City take, t taking over to get our gold, or one of the families in Urena getting everyone hooked on their dope in order to take over, or even the NCR wanting to annex us. I tell you, the NCR is our best bet, but they're all just out for our gold. Reading's still independent so far. Other rumors? What a mingo! I want a mingo is just the single ornery, orneriest critter there is. Tallest two men, stronger than a bull brahmin, and with flopping suckers instead of arms. Can't be hurt with guns neither. Supposedly, Injuns called him up for revenge on the white man for what the war did. I don't put much stock on that, though. Other rumours. Flying machine. Cover of my miners were flying a bit themselves, jetting around if you catch my drift a while back. They swore up and down they saw a ship fly past going southwest. Okay. Oh, maybe that's similar to the um, the one in uh, Klamath? Yeah. Could be. So that's what was that, the Enclave? Uh, tell me about something else. Garden of Eden creation kit! Uh, sounds pretty impressive if I had it, something like that. You sure wouldn't find me grubbing around in the dirt to make ends meet now, would you? Guess not. Uh, jobs. Tell, uh, what's the job you want? Got a great big old digger machine down in my mind. Problem is that the control chip for it didn't work, don't work anymore. Any new one? How do I fit in? The great one, a Mingo mine, just west of town. Should have one of those... Same excavator machines. It's been abandoned for quite some time, so I'm guessing they should have a working chip in their machines. How come you haven't done it already? You see, the Great One Amingo Mine's haunted. People go there and they don't come back. It's a big reason it's been shut down. It used to be a high roller type place. Not anymore, though. You want me to go to a digging machine? You want me to get the digging machine chip out of a haunted mine? What's it worth to you? A thousand! McGrew over at the Morning Star would probably give you the same, but he's all for those new Reno thugs. I can't stand those violent guys, so let's give, let me give you the money. Mum, it's pretty dangerous. It isn't a cakewalk, sweetheart, but you look like someone who can take care of themselves. Anyhow, you bring me the chip and you get the cash. Interested? I am interested. Uh, okay, I'll see you around. Uh, okay, so I assume that's what's over here. Um, through here. But, ooh, I haven't actually been in the Morningstar mine yet. So he might... So apparently he's going to be in... Name's Dangerous Dan McGrew. I run the morning sun mine. What can I do for you? Why do they call you Dangerous? Because I'm nothing but the biggest, meanest, mind-crawling... Mind-crawling, gully-wumping, snake-eating buck in these here parts. Dangerous Dan McGrew. That's me. Uh, let me ask you something else. What's going on in town? Funny you of all people should ask that. There's all kinds of funny things going on here in town lately. Uh, okay, let me ask you something else. Do you mean the excavator chip? You know what the, what's going on with the excavator chip. I want it, and I bet you're smart enough to realize the modular barge wants it too. But it best all the way around if you sell it to me. Why is it better to sell to you? Selling the chip to Marge makes her backers look better. The NCR backs Marge, and if they take over here in Reading, we're in trouble. Much better to back me and my pals in New Reno. Why would that be trouble? Everyone wants what Reading's got. Some folks are going to be nicer about how they get, get it out of us, though. Let me explain the situation. Okay. We mine gold. Everyone wants it. Send it all the way to Vault City, New Reno, even down to the NCR. You might say that Reading has something for everybody. That's what keeps us independent. Yeah, I think that someone would try to control Reading. What makes you think they haven't? Everyone likes to have Reading under their belt. My guess is that someone will get us pretty soon. But the only thing we can do is choose our master if we want to survive. What do you mean? I mean that we're going to we're going to be put under someone's thumb. Only a fool thinks otherwise. Our choice is to pick the lightest thumb. Which, of course, you've done. You bet I have. If we don't ally ourselves with one of the families in New Reno, you can just kiss Redding goodbye. At least any type of Redding that I'd want to live in. What do you mean? If the NCR takes over, Redding, Redding's going to be put under the thumb hard. They aren't really big on personal freedom. They're going to send Redding into another splotch on the new California Republic map. The Redding I know will be gone forever. What about Vault City? Vault City? <laughs> uh, those bigots would turn Redding into a slave labor camp. They don't see anyone who's not one of their precious citizens as being worth a warm bucket of spit. Spending my life bowing and scraping to those guys isn't my idea of any kind of life. So how's New Reno different? New Reno is strong enough to protect Redding from the other two. Since New Reno's divvied up amongst different gang families, it's divided enough to give us our best chance for autonomy. 
in New Reno, they don't care how we run things, as long as they get their gold. Mm, that doesn't sound so great either. This ain't a perfect world, chum. Sometimes you've got to make the best of a bad situation. Just turns out that bad people may be the best bet for Redding. Not everyone sees it that way, though. Uh, so what do you think is going to happen? Don't know for sure, but things are heating up. Whatever city is the strongest backers here in Reading is going to get the whole pie. I'm just doing uh, my hardest to make sure it's New Reno that wins. That way I see that's Reading's only chance. How can you help? Best thing to do is take, make my mind prosper and make sure my miners know who's paying the bills. The fact that they get all their happy source from New Reno makes the place a lot more popular too. Happy source is going to be drugs and stuff in it. Booze, chems, all sorts of chemical recreation. You name it, New Reno supplies it. It's just about the only thing that some of my miners work for. Be hard to pay, pay if something ever happened to that. Okay. Jet supply. Right now, we don't get hardly enough jet in town to keep everyone happy. I sure hope those next few caravans get through all right. Anything else I can ask? Garden of Eden creation kit. Never heard of something like that. I tend to find my Eden and lose sweet arms. Search continues. Do you have a wrench? I just want to search. I want to see if he's got if there's a wrench in one of these. Hmm. Wrench in Morning Star. Because they might get a bit kind of oh, you shouldn't be in there. That's that. That's not a wrench. I should probably go for the one at the far end and move forward. <gasps> yes. Okay, so the other one certainly wasn't a wrench then. There we go. Um, that seems useful. Well, I mean that that does make me. I know I'm no I'm not entirely sure I should trust the guys in Morningstar, but that's there where I'm getting a a wrench from. So we've got to take that into consideration. Um, we'll have to think about this. Um, hmm. I assume we're going to have to think about, do we want to actually get involved down here? It's a thousand monetary units. Dollars, caps, whatever. I think some of them are caps, sometimes. So we are going to want to think about that. We can just leave. We can just head up to Vault City now. Get the, like, well, do this quest, which I assume will get me the... Uh, repair kit from Vault City that was mentioned. Um, then we can get the car part and then we can take it back, although we won't have the money, but this will be a good source of... That, so this will get us close to that money, so we're going to have to think about it. Hmm. No one in here offered us it, did they? No. No, they didn't. Okay. There we go. Got ourselves a wrench. We're kind of sorted working towards these things uh, so next time we'll head off hand in a lot a few of these kind of questy things hopefully have a shot at getting ourselves a car that works but that'll be next time thanks for watching everyone thanks for watching